Hello and welcome everyone back to Kerbal Space Program. It's been a while. Um, since there was an update, we lost all of our mods, but I still have our progress saved. Last time we landed on the moon, we've got 615 science to spend. Uh, wow. That is, that is impressive. I can't wait to waste it all. And we will slip two drogue shoots in as well. The chances of us actually recovering this are quite slim, but I like to have the option just in case we do really well and it's like, oh, we can make it through this without death. And drug shoots go first. All right. We've got our two engines and that is the final stage, the emergency stage. Slash science stage. Uh, oh yes, and the thing I said was super important once again. <laughs> the the communications. Um, it's going to be hard to pack this in. So I'm just going to try my best. Oh, what do you look at the genius? Sometimes you guys are just genius. It still s technically says it has worse delta V, but I'm gonna trust it because I'm gonna trust you guys on this one. All right, let's go ahead and grab a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful SRB to throw on that shrimp. No, we want big boy. Nope, not large enough. Kickback? No, we got Pollock. Oh my, this is really overkill. Damn. Wow. Oh boy. Uh. Yeah, 6,000 meters per second delta V, probably enough. Won't lie. Will not lie. That is probably going to get us to our destination pretty quickly. All right, yeah, I think that will do it. We'll name it after a random person in chat, uh, the pancake. Pancake mark. One. Fantastic. This is gonna bring back all the science. Oh, wait a second, it needs to land. I almost forgot about that. It needs to land if it's going to come back. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't actually have to land. We don't have to attempt to land on Minmus, but it would be really cool if we did. So I'm just going to give it the capability because you never know. You never know. You never know. And I always put all the landing light. No, that's that's a little bit overkill. Just do four. Minmus has like super low gravity anyways. Let's go to Minmus. Let's go to Minmus. Minmus gang. Let's go. Minmus together. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. Or Pantastic because pancakes. Uh, all right, count down with me. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. I messed up the staging. Wait, which engine is that? That one, right? Yeah. Three. Two, one. Beautiful, no mistakes were made. Definitely didn't have to fix the staging at the literal last moment. I would never make a mistake that drastic at the last second. Ridiculous. How dare you accuse me of such a thing. Honestly, we're just gonna conserve the liquid fuel and we're gonna let the uh, solid do most of the work here. No reason to uh, waste energy. Look at it go! Woo! Going to Minmus. Where are we going? We're going to Minmus. Where are we going? <laughs> Can anyone tell me where we're going today? We're gonna grab the turn. No, we're gonna do that at 10,000. 10,000. 10,000. Ready? Seven. Eight. Nine, I'll start turning. Ten. 
All right, I want to be at 45 degree. Oh, I don't have enough. Okay, gimbal from Skipper should help out. Gimbal me. Gimbal me. Okay, I don't have enough gimbal to actually turn like that, but. There we go. There we go. Fantastic. Okay, you're going a little bit further than I'd like, but that's fine. It's fine. All right. Oh, that made... No, that actually did work. What am I talking about? That's going up, so the other way is going down. Fantastic. The process of deduction. There's two options, and it's not that one. I shouldn't have even used that maneuver node. I already knew how to do this. Yes. Yes! Yes! We did it! Thank you, Noah Tribble, for the 10 Canadian dollars. Look at that! We got our intercept! Knowing where the airport is, knowing where the planet is, knowing where the moon is, you know. Here we go. I'm gonna do my job now. We're gonna land right here. It's gonna be great. It's very bumpy on Minmus, so landing... The challenging part of landing is landing on a flat area, but I see this area right here. And that is going to be our target. Yeah, we're gonna get right over it. I'm actually gonna slow, uh, let it go a little bit further, just so that we can purposefully go above it. All right. Steady, slow and steady. All right, we have SAS, so I think it can hold on. Don't fall. It's falling, okay. So we did a little bit of a hop, which is fine. Um, this controlled hop is going to bring us to the flat area. Flat area time. Ready? One. Do, 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 do. We did it! We did it, Reddit. Oh my god. We landed. Beautiful! Wow! That wasn't just good, that was amazing. 150 science for me. This will be less, but we're doubling up. I know we could go to like a different part of Minmus and get more science, but I'm too lazy to do that. Alright, temperature, data. We got barometer. Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot of science we're getting here. Okay. Great. The, the, the mystery goo module. A high quality. High quality. And that's it. We've got everything we came here for, and it's time to go back home. So, where we currently are is not really in the right direction, um, but we can go in the right direction. I actually think that we can see Kerbin from here, possibly, potentially. Oh my god, we can! So, this is really fun, because we just have to aim for Kerbin. I can literally do this off a of site. Ready? Okay. This is going to be so skilled. So skilled right here. Okay, initial takeoff, and now pointing towards our target. Let's get into a little bit of a angle here where I can actually see. All right, we need to go a little bit lower this way. A little bit more this way. A little bit more this way. A little bit more this way. And there we go. We are going towards Kerbin, boys. We're going towards Kerbin. Okay. So, 
Let's finish this mission before Charlotte bites my hands off. We're going to go all the way to the periapsis. Boom. We're going to flip around, drop our orbit even more. Actually, is that the light side of Kerbin? I just, I just want to not land at night. We. This is such a compact pod. Very efficient. I'm not really too concerned about something going horribly wrong. Um, we even have the emergency boosters on it. We could slow ourselves down really quickly if we really had to. Although, that's going to be facing the opposite direction than we want to. Uh, <laughs> if we want to speed up towards the ground, we can! How exciting! They only have 64 meters per second of... You know what, let's go ahead and use them. We've got them, so might as well. Ready? We... Wow! That is very large particle effects for considering the size of those boosters. Jeez. Beautiful. Literally doing nothing to slow us down, but beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Alright, the camera has changed, which means we are now on track to begin hitting that atmosphere. I'm going to turn off SAS because the wind should just naturally pull us in the direction we need to be going. Should. Keyword should. Okay, I'm going to turn SAS back on. <laughs> just just for a moment. I don't know if we're bottom heavy. The reason I burned that... Uh... Oh, no, that's monopropellant. That's not the fuel. Oh, shoot. Hopefully we aren't bottom heavy. We want to be top heavy this time. That's That's our best way to survive. We have so much scientific data riding on this capsule. It would be a real shame if the pancake was destroyed. I'm a huge fan of the pancake. Pancake gang. Look at it. It is a good looking probe. Good looking probe. Ready to re-enter. Mmm. That is some good engineering. I wonder who designed it. I would be proud to have this craft named after me. Absolutely proud. Alright, we're going to turn off SAS. Like I said before, it should be able to handle itself. And it's time to get toasty. Like, real toasty. Re-entering the atmosphere. Burning through the clouds. We're gonna land on someone's house. <laughs> oh, hopefully the, the parachutes deploy. <laughs> or that song could become reality very quickly. The doors on the Science Junior are open. Uh, thankfully, it seems like it's not causing an issue. I have actually lost uh, ships to that before, though, so thank you for telling me. Pancake is cooking in the sky. We're all gonna die. <laughs> it's fantastic. The the best way to cook pancakes. Nine ninety nine. The the air fryer orbital edition. We can we can ship it straight to your door, and if you call now, we will throw in a second one, absolutely free. But wait, there's more. If you call now and say the keyword Spike Viper, we will throw in a third one! Also free for a total of three orbital air fryers. I know. I know. Could you even imagine getting three orbital air fryers for the low cost of $9.99? It's fantastic. Charlotte is has hiccups. <laughs> All right, it's time for the drug shoots. I think I am prepared to say that this was a success. At this point, there is not much that could go wrong. Um, don't quote me on that, but there really isn't much that could go wrong. Well, still don't quote me on that, but there really is not much that could go wrong. <laughs> I mean, I'm just being honest. 
Do, 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 do. Oh, look, we're right by a beach with a city on it. How oh, nice. Is that Florida? Florida gang, we made it. We made it to Florida after all this time. It's right there. This was a really this was a really complicated way to get pancakes to Florida, but I'm I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad our engineers invested so much time and money into it. All right. Okay, so we actually kind of want to flip this so that it's pancake facing down. All right. Five, four, three, two, one, and we did it. Not a single thing went wrong. What is happening? Um, since when could things go underwater? Uh, when was this a thing? Um, what? Was this in the update? I have never had this happen before. Detach the heat sh that's that's a good idea because it's heavy. Um Charlotte, you just alt tabbed. <laughs> um It seems that the heat shield was actually helping, not hurting. What is going on? Could, could someone please Google if this is an update? Because I have no clue what's going on right now. Um. Alright, new plan. Wait. Wait a second. Uh, docking mode. What the heck is going on? <laughs> this isn't supposed to happen. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd say so. I'd agree with that. All right, um, I think this is one of those times where I can safely open the debugging menu and be like, this isn't cheating. <laughs> This is not cheating, all right? Thank you. Um, we're going to just hack gravity and just turn gravity down to undo this. Can I recover it now? Ah! Very nice. Ve the <laughs> pancake's got a little bit tiny. Tiny little bit wet, little bit. <laughs> let's un let's undo that. <laughs> what? I've never experienced that in this game before. Oh, I'm never gonna be able to get it back to one. Whatever, whatever. Good enough. <laughs> All right, we got 421 science. And now we have over a million buckaroos, so extremely, extremely successful. And uh, thank you all for watching. I promised Kerbal Space Program and I delivered Kerbal Space Program. So it's time for you to deliver that subscription and notification bell. See, see what I did there? I'm, I'm giving you guys content, so you give me success. It's fair. It's a fair world. Buy GameStop. <laughs>